distinguished guests. Our next bout of the evening to be fought over three three minute rounds under amateur mixed martial arts rules in the flyweight division. So, introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, he enters the cage tonight with a record three victories, no defeats, representing Fight Academy Island. Please welcome Gerard Burns. His opponent this evening, standing across the cage, fighting out of the red corner, representing MMA unit from Coventry. He enters with a record, four victories, two defeats. Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise and welcome Sofan. Your referee in charge of the action, Mr. Paul Crossley. Well, the cage door closes yet again here at Celtic Gladiator number 30. Safiyan Ashik fighting out of the red corner, the white shorts representing MMA unit Coventry taking on Fight Academy Ireland's Gerard Burns, 3-0. On paper, a tasty contest here, Jay. Yeah, and a nice right hand to open for Ashik. Gets straight in on that single leg, pushes Burns to the fence, and he gets him down. And there was a good bit of build-up in the walkouts and stuff, Steve. Nice little bit of niggle between these two already. Always gets you a little bit more hyped up for the fight itself. Yeah, Burns walking to the center of the cage and saying, this space is mine. Been a chic since the round has started has been the one putting the pressure on yeah, against. Putting the pressure on, but good defense there. Good hips, nice underhook across under, underneath the armpit for Burns. Sheik is gonna have a real tough job of getting him down from there unless he can um, establish a better position. So Burns doing the right things, not allowing him to connect his hands. And he also, from that position, can't switch easily to a single leg, so it's good defense. Sheik just kind of trying to chip away with those knees to the inside of the right thigh, but. Jared Burns looking up at our referee like, come on, we're just we're just standing here. Yeah, I mean, his efforts were better served getting out himself. Well, absolutely. I mean, Sofian Sheik is, was doing enough to keep the fight against the cage. He's chipping away. He was looking for position. Yeah, if he stripped that arm away, that's a good start. If he could get a whiz over his left arm and free his left leg as well, but he's opting to keep that left arm underneath his body. Yeah, it's dropped is, out. It's, it's working, but it's um, harder to free himself from there. Ashiki almost gets him down, but Burns won't accept it. No, Stays posted. It's going to work back up and hips, turn in. Turns back into his man. A great takedown defense on display from the Fight Academy Ireland. Yeah, and gets what he wants out of Oh! Was that a fall or was that left hook dropping I think that, sure. a little bit of both. Left hook definitely landed, but Ashik obviously composed. Yeah, Burns blasted forward there. I think Ashik was on the back foot and the, as the punches came in, so as you say, Steve, a little bit of both, but good work from Burns, but Ashik it regains his composure and then starts to press Burns back against the fence. Well, the referee will be looking at these positions and thinking about whether he's doing enough to remain there. You know, if it's time after time, it tends to be the first time that will give you a bit more of a benefit of the doubt. After that, they want to see you be uh, be active. Dropping some knees through the middle. He constantly chips away at those knees, but he's having having such a hard time changing the level to secure the takedown. Yeah, nice from Burns and a big right hand left to And then we're in beautiful first round from these two young men. Now well, we're not touching gloves. We're meeting in the middle, straight in on the single. Ashik really got the. Oh, I thought he had the hands yeah, clasped. Balance there from Burns. Burns is just refusing to be taken to the floor. Says. Balance using the cage to his advantage as an extra sort of post and uh, nice wide legs. Right, he's trying to snatch on a guillotine there. But he's got that, the underhook. If he can free himself, it'll be easy for him to slide that through. Decides to give it up maybe and uh, just defend. Oh, nice, no, sliding you know, the, he's trying the to, arm through yeah. now. 
trying to slide that left arm in. I mean, the right arm does look deep under the neck. If you can make a connection, get a high elbow. And there he is, he's pulling. That looks tight. High elbow. Oh, picks him up. Gonna slam out of oh, it, he can't. The guard. This could be all over. That is a tight guillotine. He's pushing up with the left yeah, hand. And there's there. the, the tap. tap. Phenomenal performance from the Northern Irish lad. Ladies and gentlemen, distinguished guests, at a time of 58 seconds of the second round, your winner by guillotine in the blue corner, Gerald!